next we have um, Neeraj Gupta from IPHT 2020 batch. Um, Neeraj, are you here? Thank yeah, you. hello. Good evening, everyone. So making it more interacting, I'm going to present the slides, OK? OK, so here you can see uh, I'll be presenting how the neuralizers actually work. OK, here's the movie, uh, Men in Black, uh, from where the neuralizer concept has been taken. This is not working. Yeah, so uh, those who have not seen the movie, here's a short clip uh, of the man in black. Uh, he's SNC, he's having the neuralizer device. With that device, uh, when it is turned on, uh, the memories of all these observers will be just wiped out, like boom. Okay, so the movie actually described it as electrochemical uh, transmitting zero synapse transmitter, okay? Wait. Yeah, so uh, uh, how these neuralizers work according to the movie? These neuralizers isolate and measure electric impulse in one spray, and then specifically uh, the ones for memory. Then it deleted the memories of specific time and date. So let's talk about memory. What is memory? And then I'll explain uh, how this neuralizer thing, how wiping out one's memory is possible. So memory, what is memory? Memory is created when new synaptic connections between neurons are formed. Often they fire to each other and how strongly they are connected to each other. Okay, so here you can see uh, two neurons are there which are connected by a synapse. So forming of this synapse and all the synaptic connections uh, lead to formation of memory. Here are the connections. Okay, so how does this neuralizer work? Suppose this is the neuralizer, okay? When it is turned on, uh, the fl uh, flash will come like this, okay? Now this light signal will travel uh, through the eyes to the, uh, to the observer's brain, like this. Your screen is frozen. network seems to be an issue. It's my network, that's the issue. No, no, he's frozen, he's frozen. Okay. I think, yeah, he's frozen. Hello, hello, hello. Uh, yes, sorry. Yeah, I just now. disconnected, right? Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Am I audible, right? The screen is visible. The screen is not visible, but you are audible. Okay. No? Yes, the screen is visible. So I was talking about the explanations, how this neuralizer and wiping off the memories. Uh, I was saying how uh, uh, this flash of light or light can actually wipe out uh, one's memory. This is possible. Uh, here is new field of research uh, that is called optogenetics. In this, op uh, in this field, actually what happens, uh, genetic engineering is used to make certain cells, typically neurons to sensitive to certain kinds of light, okay? This has already, already been done in mouse, inserting a fiber optic cable into the mouse spray. And uh, it is su surprising that these rats actually lost their memories when lasers were put on and off. That is quite interesting, you know? So uh, mouse's brain and the human brains are different. How this can actually uh, be real. This can actually be real uh, if if the people are infected uh, by light sensitive proteins of optogenetics, okay? And it's made sure that these proteins only react to the flash of the neural neuralizer and uh, not other every other lights. Then that electrical signal can travel from the eyes to brain could disrupt or excite or confuse neurons associated with 
memory like seizures can do. Okay, uh, next explanation is some might think that this is not practical, this can't happen. Okay, so here is one disease or one uh, you can say symptom or uh, anything uh, that is photosensitive uh, epilepsy. In this, what actually happens? Uh, this is a condition where flashing lights, pattern of light or visual patterns can tickle a susceptible brain uh, in such a way that it causes a misfire seizure resulting memory loss. Okay, so uh, uh, from this condition, actually we can say that uh, this, uh, uh, we can say this MIB, men in black uh, neuralizer is just a fiction. This can be actually possible. Uh, this can be possible, made possible if uh, there is certain trigger, uh, might be innovated by any brilliant minds, or you know, uh, it can be just given by aliens, who knows. So that come in, uh, if uh, that trigger, that flash of light, that uh, visual pattern if uh, is flashed through the neuralizer, that can come through eyes, that would affect uh, anyone's brain, uh, it's similar way that affect the memory in epilepsy. Okay. Oh God. Okay, so here's the interesting part. Just uh, look at the top of this uh, neuralizer. Boom. Thank you. Thank you so much, Neeraj. That was great. We might forget what you said now. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay.